And before we get to your final forecast, Chief Meteorologist Chris Nation breaks down what's up with weather in his Nation Report. Chris, we've already talked about black ice and cold fronts, but we're also in an area that has a lot of rivers. Could those be dangerous as well? That's right, Katrin. This morning we're going to talk about flash flooding. And of course, I know that rarely ever happens around here, but it's still something we should talk about. Let's step out so you can see the full picture. I want to talk about the difference between a flash flood watch and a flash flood warning. Notice the conditions around the car. Fairly dry. That means conditions are favorable for flooding and that you have time, but you need to be prepared or getting prepared. Because the other one, a flash flood warning, means this. That is when the waters have already begun. Flash flooding is imminent or occurring. And you need to take action immediately. Now, coming up tomorrow, we're going to talk about how very little water can actually wind up causing your car to float away in these conditions.